the Fox 23 game of the week. Sepulpa at Claremore, a great showdown between two teams, both trying to have a long overdue postseason breakout. Fox 23 Spencer Tillis joins us live from Claremore. Spencer, what a game between two very evenly matched teams. Yeah, that's absolutely right, Nathan. We knew that this was going to be a high scoring game. And if you look behind me, I got a few friends with me right now. Claremore pretty excited. They're having a historic season coming into this thing and they came out juiced and ready to go for this one and they put on a show for their home fans. Two high scoring offenses going at it and they were lighting up the scoreboard early in this one. Opening drive for the Zebras and they would gallop down the field before Braxton Etheridge finds Gage Deckard and look at the move to shake the defender as he takes it in from 15 yards out. Claremore strikes first to take a 7-0 lead. The Chieftains down 10 at one point, but they would fight their way back. Golden Howard dropping back to pass and he finds Keelan Edwards. And there is a reason he's headed to Emporia State next year. Sepulpa eventually would take a 21-17 lead in the second, but the Zebras would go on a run of their own. And it started with this. Walker Dunaway filling the kickoff at the 9 yard line and he takes it 91 yards the other way for the score. The very next play from scrimmage they'd force an interception from the Chieftains and then on their ensuing drive they would do this. Etheridge back to Deckard one more time. This one from 48 yards out as Claremore would take a 31 to 21 lead into the half. Back and forth would go all the way to the fourth quarter. Sepulpa was down 14 with five minutes to play. But this touchdown strike from Howard over to Trey Morrow had the Chieftains within one with just over a minute left. Sepulpa deciding to go for two in the win. And here we go. It's a trick play, a direct snap to the running back. But Joshua Bump is there to blow up the play in the backfield. And Claremore holds on to take a thriller, 48 to 47 the final. This was really one of the best games that I've gotten a chance to cover this entire year. Back and forth the entire way, and just when it looked like Sepulpa was out of this thing, they fight their way back, but it was Claremore at the end able to hold on. They're going to advance now to the quarterfinals, and what a season it has been for the Zebras. And it's not done just yet. They're going to have a chance now to continue on with this historic run, Nathan. It has been fun to watch, and we get at least one more week with them, so I can't wait to see what they do next time out. Let's send things back on over to you. Yeah, what an exciting game there. They will play Elgin in the quarterfinals next week.